what's up you guys i am here uh traveling i'm actually in the goodwill of silicon valley uh, up north not used to this spot but i will be checking it out and checking what i can find and this is going back to the original videos if you guys are loving the videos and you do want to make more remember hit that like button as well as that please hit the subscribe button if you're not already hit that bell button if you want to see when i upload immediately let's get it so in here fresh, you know, like we do, and I'm rocking that Jordan fit, as well as the sub cap. Uh, let's see what they got. Okay, I see some pennies right here, check it out. I see the pennies. Not bad, not bad. Let's see, 2008, 11 and a half, a little dirty. <laughs> that is crazy. I haven't even seen the bottoms like this. This thing got all like, just the whole thing's gone. Uh, I thought for a second, you know. I feel like Ricardo Montalban right here. Gotta hit up the jackets, no matter what. It is summertime, but I do got that sadness. So I gotta check nonetheless. So sadly, I didn't find anything in the uh, jackets. So I'm checking out some hats and then onto the t-shirts. You know what's up. So check it out first rack you got the made in usa double xl specialized tee with the button still on it sick piece if you guys are into writing so check it out the price is a little different over here 349 not bad it's a crazy uh all over print tee it does say globe and it is specialized so you know i might pick that one up They do got a vintage tee right here. I'm thinking maybe 93, 94 because of this tag. Um, Atmel. Just going up. Success. It's in the bag. And you guys can see more shirts. Let's hit it. So I do got to say this one's so sick because this is a grad night. But it's for 1994 and you guys can see see Aladdin and uh, Jasmine on that uh, magic carpet this is going back to it right here but this is a grad night and this is a Arabian night that is pretty cool going back to another time another place you guys seize it because I seize it it's like a nice older Stussy got the nice print right there with the double S's sticking out let's see how much let's see how much another 349 come alive check out on the least sport size medium 49ers five decade five ring anniversary tee it's not bad throws hammer the slap heard around the world no back though no it is not my basket. <laughs> the dealio is over here is I found more hats. Found more hats. Still looking. Eminem's yeah. life. Gotta check the spots, man. I'm here in the mugs. You guys know I collect those mugs, man. I'm hoping to find something crazy. Check out that one. Let's hit it. Oh. Look, look, look. You see it? You see that's bad luck right here. They just put that up there. That's bad luck. I don't like it. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. <laughs> Check it out. How to show this one, man, for you Cali lovers out there. I'm still in Cali. You got the Cali Sway with the um, Bugs and Taz. It's a 5X. It's so crazy. Sleepwear at its finest, man. Let's see, let's see. It is 349. 
Then we got some NMDs over here, but um, further inspection, check that out. Uh -uh. How much are they wanting to? I don't know, even the price is gone. What the hell? Did someone slip one? Did someone come in here and slip some shoes out for others? What the hell? Man, that thing is beat. I mean, it is what it is, though. You know, someone's gonna want them. Someone's gonna keep them. I don't know. Not me. It's not me. Other than that, I did check out what I could. And I'm taking on to the next spot. Let's go. You know we're here at a new spot. Salvation Army in Gilroy. Let's hit it up. Dude, I found a brick a brack over here. Hmm? It's crazy, man. And there we go, check it out for $4.99, 1992 Vietnam Veterans Memorial, Washington DC with the 84 licensing on it. It's a pretty good start right there. It's pretty sick. You gotta love it. What was it just talking about, huh? What was it just talking about? The lightsaber, huh? Hmm? in here and you gotta remember man Josh Groban he likes his girls to pop you know it's up always sunny but we in the hats let's go check it out so we got a couple hat scoop ups here so check out the Colorado Rockies baseball it does have the um, you know one size fits all. This say the game. This have the official licensing on there. It's a very nice with a green brim. Tells all, like I always say. Um, not bad. Seriously, not bad. And then this one's crazy because this one's just like a clean essential Tommy Hilfiger hat. Literally, just like with this stretch back on it. And there's the Tommy uh, tags right there. <laughs> I mean, I was that's surprising, very surprising. So I don't know if I'm gonna pick them both or what I'm gonna do with it. I'm holding on to it for now, and I gotta check out some more. Nice Woolrich, you know, not too old right here, but uh, $7.99. It's a corduroy jacket, okay? But on the inside, it's got that Aztec print, just so sick, man. Replacements and all, it's still here. Oh man, I'm so tempted to just buy it and then flip it inside out and just wear it like that. You, know, you never know. So sick. It's a nice come up. So all that was found in the shoe section here, this is Dark's shoe section, is some uh, Jordan Fusions? Jordan 7 Fusions over here? Hmm, looks very interesting. <laughs> but they want 20 bucks. I'm not copping. Ooh, but I do see some hats over there. We'll check it out. <laughs> and look what I was just saying, there's some hats over here, that's awesome. They're finding a Taz hat, let's see what it is. So it's Acme Kids, so it's got to be a youth fit, made in USA. You can see that already on that snap. So let's delve into it. 1991. Awesome. Love how his like legs are coming out of the brim. Huh. Cool, cool. Still got to check on the prizes over here. I have no idea. And if you guys don't see what I'm doing right here, okay, I got actually, it's kind of dark, but I do like picked up like some type of tote bag and I shipped everything in here so I don't have to carry a cart around. Okay, this is called Innovation right here. And just right next to it, look what was found over here. Huh? That polo by Ralph Lauren uh, scarf. Where's the, oh, it's right here. There's the writer. Okay, this, this, this is a... Uh, this is a nice find right here. Very nice find. 
screw the prices. That's why I keep saying where are all the other prices. I don't get it. You're not telling me. No, I found it. I found it. I found it. <laughs> Check it out on sunglasses. Smith and Wesson. Is it cool? Cool protection. Cool little protective glasses. I don't know if sunglasses. These like giveaways. I have no idea. Let's see. Mm, they say elite on them. It's pretty cool. What do you guys think? Looking good? Smexy? I don't know. I'll keep checking. Oh my gosh. This just dropped from up there. Oh my god. Where the hell did it go? You gotta be kidding. This thing was. This thing was like. On, about to drop on my hand. Where did it go? You gotta be kidding. Oh, it's right there. Look at that. You see it? Look at this thing. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. The dangers of the thrift store, for real. Oh man, this is this is what you get for a, you know, like I don't know, sucking back on some like garlic right here for like your whole life. Oh my gosh, no way. Oh my gosh, I'm not even mess with it anymore. This is too crazy. So I'm taking off from there. They're pretty crazy come ups, but that spider took the cake. Seriously, that's the biggest spider I've ever come across at the thrift. Let's get into it. Let's go. I'm at the new spot, okay? And check out what I'm seeing. See some Gucci, Snoochie, Woochie, Poochie. You know, I don't apologize for that. Let's move this to the side. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna try my best here. Oh no, it just comes off. Let's see if it's bootleg or if it's real. No way, okay. I gotta check this one out right off the bat. Okay, do you see this already? You see the logo? This is already looking good. I could see that it's probably missing. Yeah, it's missing the uh, the clasp there. Do you see the pattern right there? No way. Okay, let's check the inside. First, with all this Gucci stuff, let's check the zipper itself. Now, the zipper has the Gucci logo on the underside. Oh my gosh, do you see it? I see it already. I didn't even see the price. <gasps> the price is $6.99. And let's see if it's got that Gucci. Flip it over. There it is. Oh my gosh. Super legit? What? Goodwill coming through? Morgan Hill. You guys are awesome. Man, up north, man. Just being up north, treat me right. What? That is crazy. Let's see if there's any flaws. I mean, you can see the leather, the quality, the stitching. Oh, I see something right here, look. Oh, it needs to be screwed in right there. Oh, I got that, man. I'll fix that up. You see, look, somebody was trying to fix it before, and that's why they probably donated it. That's insane. Coming up on some actual Gucci at the thrift. I've been coming up on bootlegs like crazy. And this one's a breath of fresh air. Do you guys hear that noise? I had no idea that was going on. So that Gucci part, I'm so sorry. Okay. So I think I'm gonna wrap it up soon. Check it out. They got the Morgan Hill. It's got the hookup on the Beverly Hills Polo Club socks. Okay, two forty nine. If you want it, hit it up. Look at that. Search into the aisles, and I did find the 1987. California Raisins, the Cali Raisins toy, man, for $1.99. I'm gonna scoop. You already know I'm gonna scoop. I already got plushes. This one's in the collection, for real. Check it out, double scoops, the North Face Polar Tech. Like, it looks like deep pile, size medium in men's. Just an awesome piece, 11 bucks. And also the All Saints Zip Up in medium for uh, 10 bucks. That's what's up, man. Stay coming up, as well as that Gucci. Can't forget, I am taking off. That noise is getting annoying. Let's go. So let's get the recap straight off of this piece. So this one's an older 
Stu CT, man, this brings back a lot of memories though, standing up and doing these recaps, going back to it, to the original videos. But yeah, you got the uh, Made in Mexico tag, Stu C logo, and like I said, it does have that logo right in the front. They say Stu, you see the little two dots right there? The Uber U, and then the double S and the Y. Nice piece, it is 349 yellow tag. It's not another tee. This one's pretty cool because it's actually a Vietnam veteran memorial tee from 1992. I did pick it up for $4.99 with a half off because it was a red, white, and blue tag sale and this one came out white so it's half off of there so $2.50. Not bad. That's about another 90s piece right here. 1992. Very coincidence. Made in USA. Uh, specialized tee with a front and back. So check us out right now. With the S's all over it. This is a globe and then it's a front and back with kind of a tie-dye appearance and yes it actually has the uh, official helmet of the world mountain bike championships rag bry specialized 521 miles pins which is pretty cool a nice colorway on the shirt as well as the print on the left and the right side in the pictures like it shows what i like about this one is really nice coming up on those bigger pieces in the scarves to pick up the polo by ralph lauren scarf every time i find these at the thrift i do pick them up so it actually has the polo ralph lauren tag as well as the 60% cotton as well as that 25% de-haired Angora. So this is some high quality rabbit hair right here if you guys didn't know what Angora was. Like I said, it is summertime, but remember if you stack up now, you're good for the winter. $3 steal. That's why I did pick these up crazy enough. They were actually on my head when I left. The lady didn't know I had them and I forgot they were on my head. So I got it for a uh, five finger discount. Sorry Salvation Army if you guys see this. Uh, I didn't mean to. Well, Smith & Wesson sunglasses. I have no idea if there's any worth to it but it is pretty cool nonetheless. Oh yeah. Not to that in the hats, two vintage pieces. Like I said, the 90s Colorado Rockies green brim hats. All hats for $3 as well as this one. This one's actually a vintage 1991 Taz hat. Snapback's still good. Uh, inside's pretty good. And that's what always matters. Because I'm far away from home, I can't really put up stuff onto the Depop that I want to. So remember, these will be coming out soon. Pick up the Woolrich jacket with the Aztec print on the inside. It is corduroy, if you guys know about that. Cord life for $7.99. Not too crazy with the comps, but it is a cool piece because of that print on the inside alone. Just awesome. So onto that, I gotta apologize for the background scenery. Yes, someone just left and someone came in. So I did pick up the 1987, yes, the 1987 Cali Raisin. Just crazy, like, I don't even know, bendable character. Uh, every time I come up on this stuff, I do pick it up. Cali Raisins have a big, special place in my heart, and I did pick them up for $1.99. Had to. $9.99 to pick up the All Saints Zip up right here uh, pretty clean a little fading but that's okay check out the embroidery on the left side as well as that if you want to get technical with it the inside tags you got to check them out because it is all legit so sad yes this is a zip up it's not a t-shirt so it's a medium so if it's a little bigger remember no medium curse here that's that i did pick up this north face denali jacket the polar tech just looking deep pile super clean i did pick up for 11.99 it was a yellow tag so no sale for me no orange just an awesome piece seriously just an awesome piece do, do not come up on north face stuff too much but when i do have to scoop and last but not least i'm gonna say the cop of the day because this one was just crazy so an actual authentic gucci purse inside and out like i showed the pictures right there i just have the gucci made in italy you flip that over and you see the serial number right there as well as that i only picked that for 6.99 it was such a steal to take a risk on but let alone that being able to legit check it at the spot that's what i'm all about i mean under the zipper really I mean, under the zipper really tells you all, so it's really cool. Going to spots, not being familiar with the area, and still coming up in the end. Like I always say, knowledge is key, don't forget that. Just want to say thank you guys for watching, it was just, it really is a crazy, crazy time just going out to spots that I just don't know. Like I said, I am actually far from home, I am not in my area, so that's what I'm saying is that I'm actually coming to spots and actually feeling comfortable enough to really just branch out and search through everything, that's the thing, even in my own spots, I search through everything because you just don't know what you're gonna come up on and with all this stuff i mean that's proof but with that i'm just gonna say what i always say hit that sub button because more videos are coming this was mick from fresh from the flea